Okay, folks, I'm going to show you how to take out uh, an empty soda stream carbonator. So what you do first thing, you take your uh, soda stream machine, make sure it's firmly um, placed on a flat surface, a table or a countertop will do. So in this case, um, you would notice that the machine has a, uh, has a button at the back. You pull that down, you hold that, uh, the button down, and you twist the top of the soda stream machine sideways like that. And what you do, you just pull it up. Once you pull it up, once you pull it up, you'll see the cylinder here. Um, this one is in this case is an empty one. So what you do is go uh, twist it. Once you twist it, it comes it comes off like so. So once it comes out. Um, and you will see that, uh, that this is very light, so you will be able to handle it with one hand. Um, when you buy a new soda stream uh, carbonator, it looks like this. So you, normally when it comes, it has a plastic wrapping on top, so you take that off. Once you take it off, um, then you take the head of, uh, of the soda stream machine, you put that cylinder back in, and you just twist it on like that. Make sure it's nice and firm in there. Once you put them, you notice that there's a grooves in here at the, at the actual head of the machine, and there are grooves inside the uh, the, uh, the base unit. Um, make sure that the grooves are not aligned when you're putting in put the top of the machine back inside. Put it in, and you'll notice that the button here clicks back on, and then once you twist it over to the front, see you heard it. So that's that goes back up, and then there you have your machine. Obviously, you could operate. You put your um, your uh, your uh, container that comes with the machine. You put it in here, and you have your gas coming. As you can hear it. So that's the way you replace an empty carbonator for a soda stream.